This course is on what uh, one of my training partners calls the cat dog position. Uh, I, did, I didn't actually have a name for it. It's, it's actually a common wrestling scramble um, where you're essentially, you and your partner have the same position. You can be controlling each other's hips or potentially each other's ankles as well. And although it's a wrestling scramble, it is really useful in jujitsu too. It often comes about uh, when you're defending a takedown, it can come about when you're escaping out of side control, or even if you play the Berambolo game, you wanna have this as part of your attacks because it's another avenue to, to scramble and look towards taking your opponents back. So there are some differences in how you would use it in wrestling and in jiu-jitsu, okay? In wrestling, their goal is really just to get on top or even just expose their opponents back to the mat. Whereas in jiu-jitsu, you want to establish control, particularly taking the back, even if you end up on your back. So I think that does change the grips you would use a little bit and what is your what your primary focus is a bit as well. So uh, it should be a little bit different to how you'd see this taught in wrestling. So let's get underway with the course on the cat dog. <laughs> 